event like this. A year ago, a lot of people were very pessimistic on whether PDP could hold a successful convention where well, every part of the PDP family will be together with uh, minimal crisis coming from the states and be able to hold a convention like this. And I said when we started the exercise of reconciling and reconciliation of all our different chapters that will bring our members together, we will appreciate the importance of where we are in the country, the responsibility we have that all personal ambition must take a back seat to the ambition of the country that we have today, which is to rescue Nigeria. And that is why I want to commend and thank not just the leaders, the governors, the followers who have come together and shown that PDP, when necessary, can bring everybody together. And that's what you see here. You can see the atmosphere. You can see it's an atmosphere of unity, of a common purpose. And by the time we finish voting, we'll have a new uh, elected executive. Oh, maybe not 100%, but I think definitely we're in the 80s and 90%. And in, in political party administration, that is excellent. Uh, and again, I take you back to where we were after the election and about a year ago to see this event. Normally, it is the ruling party that normally takes lead because you expect in the ruling party there should be harmony, there should, it should be easy to organize that. The fact that the ruling party cannot even go beyond state congresses and think of doing a national committee, it asks the opposition that can come together and show leadership. I think it's a great credit to, to the entire PDP family. And, and this is something that's, that's achieved that we should not downplay because in an opposition party, it's very difficult to bring unity. But we have done that. And the reason why we have done that is that we all talk about and say what is important now, it's not even the political party, it is Nigeria. It is how we can make Nigeria better. And, and when we have differences, at the end of the day, when we reach a consensus, some people might have different views. But we say, listen, think about the country. Think about the work ahead. Because this is just the foundation for the work ahead. The work ahead is to rescue this country. The work ahead is to turn this country around. And you can't do that without a united party. And what we have shown today to Nigerians is that we have a united party. We see the importance of the responsibility before us. And we are ready and determined to turn this country around. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.